Alright, here's a story by one of my favorite and funniest guys on the internet, Mr. Jim Willie. It's called Celebration of Fire. China to upend the dollar with gold in April, question mark. What an incredible insult to the banker cabal, replete with Satanists like Uber leader Rothschild and the fiat paper currency system centered upon the U.S. dollar is upended by China during mid-April. Any wrestling of control with the gold market would enable the price to rise. Refer to a doubled gold price and a tripled silver price suddenly. The Chinese attack within the gold market could hit Satanistic bankers where they live in the fire pit of mid-April. The theme of this article is the arrival of April, the most significant month on the Satanist calendar and the month with the most extremely long list of celebrated assassination and mass murder events that they boast of. Some events are well known to follow, to follow the April pattern while the others are not. The relevance to the financial world is immediate while one considers that the Chinese have planned launch of the Shanghai Gold Price Fix, as well as the introduction of the Shanghai RMB-based Gold Futures Contract, the date arranged April 19th. This date is right smack dab in the middle of the week, marked by the celebration of fire. What an incredible insult to the banker cabal, complete with the Satanist Rothschild. The arrival of gold futures contracts in Shanghai posed an additional risk for the Western Banker Cabal, a grand crime syndicate which extends to the energy firms, the military industrial complex, the big pharmaceutical firms, and the press networks, a real valid bona fide gold contract which delivers physical gold would enable vast arbitrage to buy cheap in London and sell dear in China. Any acceleration in the arbitrage activity combined with any sincere attempt to set gold fix in an unreasonable manner that puts equilibrium as priority and the Western bankers will face the US dollar kicked to the curb and possibly global boycott. The zinger factor is that the Chinese interbank payment system, CHIPS, C-I-P-S, is ready. It serves as an alternative to the SWIFT bank system. The little known fact is, except to the hat trick letter clients, is that CHIPS was successfully field tested in late February. I knew that. It only lacks tight connection to the forex currency market and to the sovereign bond market, in particular U.S. Treasuries. The demise of the U.S. dollar is finally visible. The king dollar reign of terror is soon to come to an end. One of the most shameful eras in modern history is coming to a close. The U.S. dollar has turned toxic since QE was introduced, killing capital as quickly as foreign opponents are killed on the battlefield under false cause for war in defense of the global currency reserve. The reserve status is going away and with it the U.S. economy on a credit card. A new dollar stands at a tremendous risk of serious devaluations. So there you have it. That's Jim Willie's take on what's going on here in April. There's some other stuff in here but it's all about uh, Satanistic stuff, and I don't, I don't care about none of that stuff. Whether their symbols and why they do things on this night and not that night, and I, I don't know. I just don't think most people really care about the Satanistic side of the banker cabal we all know they're satanists so unless you wanna if you wanna study it 
uh, you can get this off of Silver Doctors and you can read the rest of it. Anyways, until next time, take care guys, keep stacking.